Hello everyone, Black Ice here, and welcome back to Pokemon Uranium. Last time we left off, we made it up to uh, Kevlar Town, went to this route, and today we're going to go to the old entrance to Naltok City, but I have done things off camera, and by off camera I mean on a live stream. <laughs> that was a lot of fun, so for those of you who made it, thank you so much, and if not, well, maybe you can catch the next one. Um, I don't really have a plan on when I do these things. I just, I don't know. They're fun. They're really fun. And I do them on YouTube now, so I'm going to be going to be doing that. But anyway, I have a lot of changes. As you can see, I have a few more Pokemon. Um, that wasn't really the uh, the thing. That, that wasn't the main goal of the live stream. I meant just to level up my existing Pokemon, but I ran into them on the way, and everyone wanted me to catch them, so I'm like, all right, I'll catch them. You know, why not? And, I don't know, they're, they're pretty cool Pokemon. So we have a S'more, which is a Bug-type Pokemon. He likes to fight. Uh, Swarm is the ability, so powers up Bug moves in a pinch. That's pretty good, I guess. Um, I don't know about his nature, or or his... He's got a lot of uh, defense EVs, apparently. Whoops. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Uh, Poison Sting, String Shot, and Leech Life. Not great, but not bad. Um, let's see, who else do we have? We have an Outen, which is another new Pokemon on the team. A normal flying type, it's quick to flee because it's scared of things. Um, it's got a good ability, Serene Grace, boosts the likelihood of added effects appearing. And it's got a good speed stat, good attack stats, and a bunch of defense EVs apparently. I don't know what gave me those, I'm guessing the Jin Monk I was fighting. Um, I was just fighting that guy in the Pokemon Center. Uh, Pack Charm, Foresight, and Quick Attack for its moves, so decent flying type. Um, and of course we have Mankey here, who has learned Low Kick since leveling up, or since, yeah, since leveling, yeah, leveling up. We have Chin Monk, who I believe has learned an Electric type move, yeah, Charge, so that's going to be interesting. I'm guessing he evolves into some kind of Electric type, but for now he's still normal. Um, and then Orchinx hasn't really changed much, I don't think Orchinx leveled up at all. But anyway, enough going over the things that have happened, let's progress and make some more things happen, how about that? We are in Passage Cave, alright, um, don't really need nowhere to go from here, okay, not that way apparently, but we have our first wild Pokemon encounter of this area, it is a, a Tonemi, which sounds suspiciously like Zubat, alright, alright, S'more, um, I'm guessing it's a flying type, so you're probably not going to be good for this fight, um, let's send out, let's go with Outen, I guess, I don't know, why not? The Wild Tone, we use Tackle. Great. That's, I guess, good. I don't know, it didn't hurt that much. Gonna use Peck. Ooh, critical hit. Very nice, Outen. Ooh, ooh, he's going many times in a row. Poison Gas. Oh no! I may have one antidote left. I hope I have one antidote left, otherwise that's gonna be quite unfortunate. I won't be able to use Outen anymore. For the rest of the area, anyway. Um, uh, Bag. Do I have an antidote? I do. One left. Great. So I can use an antidote, and I don't think I really need to use a potion right now. So last antidote. Alright, thanks for the reminder. I'll just leave that there. Alright, so do we go to the left then? Maybe. Alright, I see the wall and some mushrooms, so... Oh, what are you? Grozard. Wow. I don't, I don't know what this guy is, but let's use Leech Life and see if it works. I'm guessing he's like a ground type or a bug type, or not a bug type. Uh, rock type. Okay, I'm guessing he's not rock because Leech Life was normally effective. Um, he's ground type. Poison's not going to hurt him very much. Uh, let's switch out again. Let's go with let's go with Mankey because if he is a oh Arena Trap. Okay, well that's interesting. I guess we're going to have to fight this guy with S'more, which is okay. Sand Attack is going to get annoying, but hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to hit him with enough enough leech lifes to make this work, but unfortunately, because of his arena trap, this is going to be a long battle. Yep, we're halfway there, and he doesn't seem to have any moves that can damage me. He only seems to have moves that can slow me down in taking him out, because he will either lower my accuracy or lower my attack, both of which are really annoying, so I'm going to attempt to poison him. Let's try that. Because at least that way... Oh no, he's got Scratch. Okay. Well, it's fine. Okay. As I expected, not very effective, but we did get the poison now, so that'll go... Make the battle go a little bit faster. And there we go. 
And we can just continue to use Leech Life and recover our remaining HP. I don't plan on catching this guy because, I mean, he's annoying me right now and I don't want him on my team if he's going to be annoying like that. I mean, I know if I, he's on my side, he won't be nearly as annoying, but still. I, I don't know why. I, I, I don't want him. Get out of here, Grozard. So, even though we're missing, like, every turn, we still get some damage in with that poison. Oh my gosh, the accuracy. Alright, he's hurt by the poison again. Alright, one more turn no matter what, whether we hit him or not. I'd prefer to hit him just to get a little bit of HP back. There we go. That was an unnecessarily long battle, but there we go. We got the job done. Alright, level... Or, not level 71, but 71 experience points. Um, there's some stairs here. Dang it. I wish I had some repels. Please don't have arena trap, because I think that prevents running from battles, too. Oh, man. I think I think it does. This sucks. Alright, whatever. Just freaking leech life. Quick before he lowers your accuracy. My gosh, that's annoying. And then when he lowers my accuracy, I'll just try desperately to poison him. But luckily, this one's like fighting more. Or at least it seems like it. That growl's a little bit annoying, but, you know, it's something I could live through. Oh, and there goes the accuracy. Let's get the poison in while we still can. If we still can. I don't know. We have to get lucky and hopefully get the poison on the first shot. Alright, didn't lower my accuracy again. Will he be poisoned? No. Okay, let's try it one more time. Well, really, we're gonna try it as many times as it takes for him to get poisoned. And, you know, preferably, game, if you're listening, that would be sooner than later. Not very effective, yeah. Um, that much is clear. I should have probably just been using Leech Life this whole time. I Maybe I'm overestimating Poison Sting's capabilities of actually poisoning something. Of course, there we go, right as I say that. Um, but yeah, I kind of feel like if I used Leech Life the whole time, I would have had the battle about to, you know, over-ish. But I guess it doesn't really matter that much. We're going to get a little bit of health, and he's going to take some poison damage, and we win the battle. And hopefully we don't run into these things again so I can actually run away from them and not have to fight them, because I don't like them. Alright, it's just mushrooms here. Is there anything up here? There's a hiker. Is there anything? Oh, there's a Pokeball thingy. An escape rope. Wonderful. Okay. That's great. Uh, I guess we'll end up battling the hiker, and hopefully he doesn't have that guy. This cave is dangerous. Only the manliest men can pass it. Hey. Hey, that's wrong. You're you're wrong. You're wrong. You're false. Of course his name is Manny. <laughs> but no. It does not take a manly man to go through a cave. It could be anybody who can go through a cave as long as you have courage and spirit and desire and don't hate caves. Alright, so I'm guessing this guy's a bug type because... Oh no, bug is normally effective against bugs, so maybe he's a rock type. Let's try poison sting. See if that'll work. Uh, it doesn't even affect him. Okay, so maybe he's like a steel type. Alright, uh, that's a little scary. Uh, let's switch out for Mankey then, because he's got low kick, and if he's rock or steel, or both preferably actually, because then I can just low kick him and that's like times for effectiveness. Take that! Oh, nice. Super effective. And he's gone. S'more's gonna level up, and Mankey's gonna level up all in the same turn. So that's pretty cool. Oh, and Mankey's trying to learn Fury Swipes. Yeah, we're gonna learn Fury Swipes. Uh, let's get rid of Scratch, I guess. Um, what's the power of Scratch? 40, and Fury Swipes is 18. Okay, maybe I don't quite want to get rid of Scratch then. We'll go with uh, Leer, I guess. Like, like, the thing is, Fury Swipes, if it hits twice, it's not gonna be as good as Scratch. They're both not that great, though. And he's going to send another one of these guys out, so we're going to keep Mankey out here to get a, another sweeping low kick. Actually, this is an attack called Low Sweep, so I probably shouldn't have said that. Oh, it has Sturdy, okay. I thought it just got lucky there, but... Eh, that's fine, we can just scratch it and it's gone. Good job, Mankey. You're proving yourself to be very worthy to this team now. And Hiker Manny has been defeated. Looks like you're manly, alright. Um, yeah, bye. Let's go through here. Luckily, this cave is mostly linear, and I don't feel like I'm going to get lost. Alright, we have another one of these things that toned me. 
I'm probably not saying these uh, Pokemon names like, oh, why can't I escape? Let me out of here. Oh, I, oh, did I not? What happened? Did I use Poison Sting? Ah, oh, I used Poison Sting. So it doesn't stay on run, I gotta remember that. It resets every time, so that's kind of annoying. But hey, we can escape now. And you know what, I am gonna use um, a potion on, let's see, who could use one? Just some more, really. The rest of my Pokemon are fine. Alright, let's head on through the rest of this cave. That looks like the exit, but I am gonna go a little bit further, because it looks like it... Oh, for a second I thought that was a shiny Pokemon, I'm like, oh my god! No, it wasn't shiny though. Uh, we're gonna s run. Yeah, we're gonna run. So, is there anything over here? Yes, it's a good thing I went here. And I found a Great Ball, nice! Alright, that's... I'm gonna need that. Because apparently I can't catch Pokemon in this game. Oh no! Before we could get out, one last wild Pokemon encounter, and it is that same guy again, the barrel guy. So I'm getting out of here. Let's run away. And we have... Oh, it's more cave. Dang it. Alright, I'm gonna go to the right, because the right is always the right way, right? Uh, we have a Toad Me, we're gonna just run. Oh, come on. I Maybe I shouldn't have S'more at the front of the team. Yeah, you know what, I'm gonna... Oh, and I'm poisoned. Oh, and I use Poison Sting. I for keep forgetting it doesn't default to run. Or, not default to run, but it doesn't leave it where you last left off, and... Oh, no, I can't escape. Stop using poison gas, I'm already poisoned, you fool! Let me out of here. No. Alright, S'more. Uh, this guy's not very nice, so we're gonna run. No, S'more! You have to... You have to wake up so we can run! That's gonna hurt, and we got out of here just in time. Alright, um, actually what I'm gonna do is take one step. Two steps. Three. Am I not being poisoned? What the heck? I wanted the poison to just wear off and then use a potion on it. But um, anyway, I am going to switch uh, out end to the front. There we go. Because S'more is already level 9 anyway, so... Alright, so the poison faded, let's use a potion. Whoops, that's not the potion but area where the potions are. Alright, um, and we're pretty much good, I'd, I'd say. Let's go up these stairs and hopefully we're going the right way. Alright, what do we have here? No! Why? This stupid thing. Can I run away from him? Let's test this. Yes, okay, you can run away from him. I was just being stupid earlier. Oh, there's a hiker there who's walking around in the cutscene. What? You can't do that. You're not allowed to do that. That's not part of the game. Alright, anyway, let's run away from this guy. Alten's luckily very fast, so we can run away from just about anything. I'm surveying the area to build a trail. It's so cumbersome to have to go through this cave in order to get anywhere. Good luck, kid. Take this. You'll need it. A revive. Oh, wow. Thanks. That's very nice of you. But I don't think I'll need it. I've been pretty good about, like, potions and... Oh. There's gotta be an item there. There's gotta be, like, an item hidden there or something. No. Why? Why all the wild Pokemon battles? I mean, I'm not gonna fight these jerks. Alright. There is not. Okay. And I'm guessing there's... Okay, there's another hiker here. Somehow I find it's fun to randomly beat up on innocent traitors. Wow, you're a jerk. Like, this guy is an actual jerk. Like, I usually just call people jerks if I don't like them, but this guy's an actual jerk. Hiker Nunez, alright. Nunez, get ready to get your butt kicked by Alton and the rest of my team who's amazing and way more amazing than your team. Alright, Alton might actually have to switch out. Oh no, we're doing way more damage than he is. Yeah, we'll be fine. Alright, Alton, one more time. And I'm going to switch for the next one, though. Uh, let's see. Wow, that's good experience. All right, level 9. Good. Dunsparce. All right, uh, I will change Pokemon. I'm going to send out Shinmunk. Shinmunk versus Dunsparce. I hope he doesn't have Rollout, or else that's going to be really scary, actually. Uh, so, yeah, just keep tackling. That Stab Tackle is going to do some good damage. He's got Rage. Okay, well, this is almost like Rollout, but not quite as good. Although he gets stab on it, I guess, because rage is a normal type attack. But it looks like we're going to be able to do enough damage where his rage isn't going to be able to uh, defeat us. Especially when he does that, and right after a critical hit too, so... It seems to be going in our favor. Alright, good job Dunsparce. Er, not Dunsparce. Jinmonk. Jinmonk, you did good. You do good. You do good work. I suppose all Billies eventually get their comeuppance. 
Uh, that's kind of a weird thing to say in a Pokemon game. But alright, um, I'm going to send Orchinx to the front because I haven't used Orchinx in a little while. And I am going to uh, not heal up Alten because I think Alten's done for the game. Alright, yeah. yeah. I just wanted to make sure that those two connected, like those two sides there connected. Alright, we're going to run away from this one. Don't worry, Orchinx, you don't need to waste your time on these fools. Alright, and then we will go to the... Well, the up. At the up. I don't know if there is, like, well... No, I guess it would be north. Yeah, yeah, I guess it still would be north. We're going north. Going north to Naltok City. Oh, oh, I didn't actually mean it. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna go... Because there was, like, a thing to the... Oh, no. Never mind. Never mind. There was not, actually nothing there. Alright, Naltok City. We made it. This is, like, a weird entrance to a city. If I do say so. And why is... I feel sorry for whoever lives here. You can't get in that house. Like, seriously, why? Why Why would you have a door there? I, I want to go in. Oh, hello. There's a random thing here. TM45. It contains a tract. Nice. All right. And there's, like, graffiti on the wall, so that's kind of cool. Except it all says the same thing. It's probably this guy. Were you up to the graffiti? Welcome to now, now Talk City. I'm the designated town greeter. And you have a Outen with you. All right, let's talk to all the people around town. You look like a Pokemon trainer. I can see it in your eyes. All right. Um, I don't want to go in buildings yet. I have to talk to everyone outside first and then go inside. That's just me, though. My dream was to have a Fortog. I could trade my Bashan for one. Don't even attempt to say yes for me if you haven't got one. So do you have one? No. Sorry, guy. I don't have any of those Pokemon. Oh, is this locked? Only staff may enter here. Alright, that's fine. Uh, there's something going on over here. I bought a ticket for the first underground travel in all Tandor. Alright, well, I can't go, so you're being quite mean to me. But I have to beat the gym first. Foo foo foo, the gym leader hasn't arrived there yet. St she is still at home. Foo foo foo, okay, whatever. Um, what? What is it with, like, uh,. I hope that didn't... <laughs> a weird thing happened on my monitor. It's just like, bye. Naltok has really high elevation. Don't look over the cliff to the northwest. It's really scary. All right. I'm going to do it anyway, though. But what is it with, like, gym leaders never being at their gym? It's, like, it's kind of annoying, to be honest. That's our town anthem. I'm going to sing it at the subway inauguration in a couple of hours. All right. Uh... Hello? Or do you exist? Can I can I speak to you? No, apparently not. That was kind of weird. Alright, um... Guess we'll go... Well, let's go heal up, and then we'll go uh, talk to the people inside buildings. Because this isn't, like, too big of a place, so we can do that. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, yeah, okay, I don't need to read what you have to say, because you say the same thing every time I see you. Well, that's nice. They all just went on to the Pokemon thing at the same time. It didn't go like one, two, three, four, five like it usually does. Alright, what do you have to say? What's nice about Pokemon Centers is that they give anyone a free place to sleep for the night. It's like a free hotel, except nobody leaves mints on your pillow. Yeah, that's pretty much how it is. Heal your Pokemon before you decide to leave town. Trust me on this. Alright. Uh, you don't have to remind me, but okay. It takes a lot of work to be a cool trainer. You've got to act cool, dress cool, and be cool. Oh, and Ray's cool Pokemon. All right, you're you're weird. All right, and I can't access your laptop apparently, so I'm gonna leave. Bye, Pokemon Trainer Center. Pokemon Trainer Center. Pokemon Center. Um, did I talk to? Yeah, yeah. I talked to everyone outside, so I just have to go in the buildings, the ones that I can go into, which is like maybe three, including the Pokemon Center and Mart. Hello, old man. Hi, hi, I'm the Name Raider. I'm the fortune teller of names. I shall be pleased to rate your Pokemon's name. No! I see. Do come visit again. Alright, bye. Wait a minute. Let's take a sip of his coffee and leave. <laughs> Black Ice, the coffee bandit. Alright, there it is. Alright, yeah, yeah. So there's four buildings I can go into. My bad. Oh, um, what? Hey, who might you be? Oh no, don't tell me you're a trainer. Ah, I'm late. Just when I thought I'd get away with a little slacking. Okay, I'm out. I'll see you at the gym. Alright, so I guess that's the gym leader then. Great. Um, I, I thought I'd have to do something else to make that happen, but that's fine. Right, let's, let's stop by the mart. Hello. Uh, I'd like to buy some potions. I don't have any. Okay, let's get some more Pokeballs. Oh, I have 15. Uh, whatever, I'm getting more. 
Oh, I probably shouldn't have gotten that many. I can only get two potions now. Dang it. Oh well, that's all I really needed, I guess. They have repels here. No great balls, unfortunately. Alright, we're fine. Let's get out of here. No one else is in the mart, so I can't talk to them there. And there's like one more building I can go into. Hopefully. What do you have to say? Hello, are you a Pokemon trader? I can see you have a bright future ahead of you. Come back here when you've got more experience, and I can teach your Pokemon some strong moves. Alright, bye. That sounds... sounds quite nice. You must be good at teaching things. Well, now she is there. Okay. Good. Good. Alright, um... And I still can't go that way, so I guess all I have to do is go to the gym now. Let's check it out. Let's check out our first gym. Alright, um... Hey kid, you can call me the gym guy. Everyone does. I'm here to give you some tips along your way. Maria here specializes in normal types, which you've probably seen plenty of already. They hit hard, but steel types like Beru and Orchinx resist most of their attacks. Alright, that's great. It looks like you can skip most of these trainers, which I don't plan on doing, but I just want to check it out. Alright, so there's two trainers and the gym leader. You know what? Normally I'd say we're running out of time, but I'm going to take on these two trainers first. Finally, a challenger. Get ready to do your best. Alright, and they're cool. Remember, they're really cool, so, so act cool around them. Cool trainer Jack would like to battle. He's going to send out Alten, that's great. It's a good thing I have Orchinx here. Um, unfortunately though, my grass type attacks aren't going to be too good against Alten, so... Let's send out... Our own Alten. I don't know, maybe that'll help. Alright, he's going to use Peck, that's fine. Although, ooh, that, that hurt. Um, yeah, we'll be fine. So I, I'll use a potion if I need to. And... So that the 6 damage, if he crits me I die, but if he doesn't crit me I, I'm fine. Alright, actually I can finish this guy off without using a potion, so I'm going to do that. Wonderful. And 50-50, alright, that's kind of cool. And he's going to send out a Chin Monk, and yes, I will send out my own Chin Monk, actually. The Double Honor Battle Trainer, I like it. Alright, let's see, okay, they're both level 9 too, so it's going to come down to who's his fastest, and of course this is fastest. Alright, now it's going to come down to who can land a critical hit. And hopefully that will be my Chin Monk. Ooh, nope, that was his Chin Monk, dang it. Alright, Chin Monk, that's enough, come back. Go, Mankey. Oh wow, that's like the same thing it said in the thing, okay. Nice. Alright, all I have to- oh wow, that hurt quite a bit. Oh, but look, my anger point maxed out my attack. Get wrecked! Alright, um, I didn't know that was actually a thing. That's pretty cool, though. Alright, Mankey's gonna get some, Chin Monk's gonna get a little bit. And just like that, we defeated Cool Trainer Jack. Well, now you can challenge the gym leader. Well, I could, but I'm gonna challenge the other gym trainer first. You seem tough. Show me what you've got. Alright, I will. And we're going to fight Cool Trainer Myla, who sends out Chin Monk. All right, I'm going to send out Orchinx. And Orchinx, use Vine Whip. Oh, wow, that's that does quite some damage. I like that. Or, or Chin Monk is charging power, which raises its special defense. Luckily, Vine Whip is a physical attack. Should be anyway. Okay, good. Or maybe, I don't know, it was critical hit anyway. All right, Orchinx level 10. Very nice. And another Chin Monk. We're going to leave Warchinx out there to deal with this, well, other Pokemon, I guess. And I think on the other one, if I take damage, I'm, wow, I'm doing so much damage. This is, like, amazing. Warchinx, why haven't I just been using you the whole time? Oh, right, because I actually kind of want to raise Pokemon in this game. Haha, <laughs> alright, another critical hit, too. Warchinx is just wrecking this trainer so hard. Alright, another Chin Monk. Level 8? I think they've all been level 8, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, this one might be a little bit tougher. It looks like it may have had some more defense, or the RNG was just being a little bit weird. Alright, let's see if we can take it out in another hit. No. Alright. We're gonna take a few damage, that's fine. Finish it off with Scratch. I almost finished it off with Leech Seed, which wouldn't have been a good idea, because it would have had another opportunity to get an attack off, but... We defeated Cool Trainer Myla. Well, now we can challenge the Gym Leader. Hey, that's what the other Cool Trainer said. You guys aren't very cool or original. Alright, but um, anyway, I, guess, I think that's going to do it for me for today. Um, 
in the next episode, we will take on the gym trainer and uh, hopefully see what all that ruckus is about over to the left of the gym there. So, um, yeah, anyway, that's going to do it for me for today. So thank you all so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye, everyone. Have a great day.